In this lesson, we are continuing with pie charts. So, in this example, uh, I surveyed 120 year eight students and they were asked the question, what is your favorite sport? After the survey was done, the information was put into this pie chart. Now remember, there were 120 students. <clears throat> now, look at the information. Of the 120 students, 15% chose cricket. 10% chose rugby. 10% chose netball. 25% chose basketball. And 40% chose tennis. So the question now is, you have the percentage, if I ask you the actual number of students that chose these sports, how would you work that out using this information? In the exam, you might have a question based on that pie chart to work out the most popular sport, the least popular sport, the number of students whose favorite sport is basketball, and the number of students whose favorite sport is cricket. We're now going to work on each individual sport to see the actual number that chose that sport. Let's start with cricket. Now remember, 15% chose cricket. Now there was 120 students. So to work out the actual number, we say 15 over 100, because percentage is always over 100, times 120 over 1. And how do we go about when we multiply with fractions? We try and simplify. We cancel the zeros, right? And then, of course, we simplify. So we can say 5 goes into 10, 2 times. 5 goes into 15, 3 times. All right, what can we do? We can say 2 goes into itself once. 2 goes into 12, 6. So what are we left? 3 times 6 is 18. So 18 students chose cricket. Let's look at rugby. 10% chose rugby. Same drill. 10 over 100 times 120 over 1. Right, let's simplify. We can cancel some zeros. Ah, we can do more. Look at that. And what are we left with? 1 times 12. Easy. 12 students chose rugby. Same applies to netball. Another 10%. So let's just do it again. 10 over 100 times 120 over 1. Same drill. Cancel zeros. And we are left with 1 times 12 is 12. So 12 students, actual students, chose netball. So let's go on to basketball. 25% chose basketball. So it's 25 over 100 times 120 over 1. Let's simplify. 0, 0, cancel out. Let's have a look. 2 goes into 10, 5 times. 2 goes into 12, 6 times. 5 goes into itself once. 5 goes into 25, 5 times. And 5 times 6 is 30. So 30 kids chose basketball. Tennis, last one. 40% chose tennis. So it's 40 over 100 times 120 over 1. Cancel some zeros. Ah, we can do it more. Boom. And we're left with 4 times 12, which is 48. So 48 students chose tennis. Well, now that we've worked at all the answers, all we need to go back is to our original questions. The most popular sport was tennis. The least popular sport was netball and rugby. The number of students whose favorite sport is basketball, remember 25% of 120 was 30. And the number of students whose favorite sport is cricket, 15% of the actual 120. So that, in actual fact, is 18 students. I hope you certainly benefited from this lesson where we had a look at the percentage of students and converting the percentage into an actual number.